Halt. You there, outsider. Don't move. Look up. You see, up there in the trees, the glint of steel. Archers, we have been tracking you for the last five miles. What is your business here? Exploring this deep into the jungle. This is our territory. Who are we? We are Amazon, daughters of Ares, sisters, warriors. No others may trespass here. Ignorance is no excuse. You have violated one of our sacred rules. Save your pathetic apologies. Your words mean nothing. Besides, it is not my place to pass judgment on you, outsider. That is the right of our queen. Come. I seek audience with Hippolyta. We found an outsider along the perimeter. Darissa, Inoni. Yes, Andrea. Keep watch over this prisoner. I must speak with the Queen in private. As you wish. Hmm. Eyes forward, sister. Of course. You're an outsider. I see. How exciting. Hush, Larissa! Must you make conversation with every creature that comes stumbling into our midst? I apologize, sister. I realize that this outsider was trespassing in our village and that is unacceptable. Exactly. However, no. they do not seem no. like they meant any harm. Oh, not again. Look, they come without sword or shield, but map and compass. Perhaps they are a scout sent by one who would harm us. Perhaps. Or perhaps they have some hidden ability, some secret strength that belies their form. <gasps> Larissa! Inoni! Look how easily they fell over. I barely even pushed them. I would never question Andrea, of course, but they do not seem to be a threat. At least, immediately. I'm sorry, do you need a hand up? Why are you touching the prisoner? They got dizzy and fell down. I was checking to see if they still lived. <sighs> they seem well enough. Rise, outsider. The queen wishes to speak with you directly. Queen Hippolyta. Thank you, Andrea. Tell me, outsider, is it true? You are an adventurer exploring new lands. You did not seek to find our village, but simple misfortune brought you to us. Look me in the eyes. 
and tell me your truth. I believe you, but I cannot allow you to leave. Our safety relies upon our secrecy. Any knowledge of our location leaking out onto the mainland, that is a risk we are not willing to take. We will do our best to make you comfortable here. But do not mistake me. You may never return home. I am sorry. Andrea. Yes, Queen. Find our guest a room for the evening. Until we can accommodate them more appropriately. It will take some time to get them permanent shelter. They are not wanted here. Can we not put them with the livestock just for the time being? Andrea, we are more hospitable than that. No, I think we should put them with the head of guard. But Hippolyta... We must ensure they do not escape. Surely you cannot think of a safer place to house them. No, Your Majesty. Then it is settled. Go now. Yes, Hippolyta. Let's go. Were you listening at the door? I tried to stop her. You lie. She was asking questions. I told her not Enough. to. Enough. Where are you taking them? They are not being punished, are they? You were the one spying. You tell me. The door was too thick. Is what Larissa told me. I am taking our guest to their room. They are staying with us. It is as the Queen commands. You do not seem too pleased. It is not my place to question Hippolyta. You are angry, Andrea. Yes, you are. You are normally so stoic. But I see your eyebrow twitching. Just a centimeter. There. <gasps> I saw it too. And how am I to stay calm when I am being interrogated by you too? Tell me, outsider, what is the world like? Where you are from? What did I just say? I did not ask you. She did not. <sighs> Please, sisters, return to your post. I will answer questions after I show this one to their quarters. Ooh, where are they? Where are they staying? Why does she have that look? It scares me. My house. They are staying with me. Come. Do not touch anything. This will be your room. It is only temporary. Don't get too comfortable. There is a cot in the corner. You can use it if you wish. I will return before nightfall to check on you. 
Do not try and run. Our perimeters are guarded at all times. Dozens of trained Amazonian warriors ready to lay down their lives for their sisters. For the well-being of our tribe. It would end badly for you. I am not unsympathetic. I realize you do not want to be here. But you must learn to accept what the fates have given you. There is no going back, outsider. You are ours now. Whether you like it or not. <laughs>